So our problem is that if Sophie's dad paid $21.75 for six gallons of gas, what is the cost for one gallon of gas? So what we started with doing is taking the $21 separate from the 75 cents. You make $21 and then 7 tenths and 5 hundredths. So now what you do is the division problem of it. You take the six gallons and the $21.75. We will do the division throughout the slideshow. So now what we did is take the $21 and divide them equally up into six groups. As you can see, there are three dollars left over. And as you also could see, there are three in each group. So that is how much we have in each group so far. So now what we do is take away $18, which is the $18 that we divided up into the six gallons. And now it equals three, as you can see, $3. But this three over here is how much we have in each gallon. So, so now all you do is take the $3 that were left over and make them into 30 tenths. So now we have one tenth left over because we gave six tenths to each of the six gallons. So now in each gallon there is three dollars and six tenths. So on our division we go 37 minus 36 which would equal one tenth. Which is the one tenth we have left over. We put the six tenths up there. Which is how many tenths goes into each of these gallons. So now we take those tenths and divide them into ten hundredths. And we also have our five hundredths, so we have fifteen hundredths left over. So now we divide them equally up into six groups, and you can only put two hundredths in each gallon, which now we have three dollars and sixty two cents in each gallon, with the remainder of three left over. So now you have fifteen hundredths minus the twelve hundredths you divide them in and you have three hundredths left over. You got two in each group.